Hey, what is up, guys? Chris here, and today we are gonna be playing. Whoa. Well, that was cool. Well, today we're gonna be playing Borderlands 1. Alright, right, it's up there. Let's go there. We were gonna do another mission, but got a little sidetracked. We're gonna do this mission right now. So basically, this is episode number three. We're level seven. We're Mordecai. We got guns. We got grenades. We got shields. We got babes. We got birds. What else could we want? So right now, we're just doing the, the level up grind. Beginning of the game. Slowly making our way up there. Slowly making our way to beat the game. Hopefully there won't be more rap. That'd be mean. I'm stuck. Right there. Gotta go get it. Get it. Yeah. Come on. Let's see. And the second one. Alright, so we're gonna need to go there anyway, so let's go back to the other mission. Let's see, look, we'll do this one. This is where we get the seeds. And then we'll kill Scar, which is right there. And the thing is right here, so perfect. Hopefully, we'll level up. I need a bit more. We don't care about no skulls unless they're... What? Oh, okay. Whoops. Press the wrong button. LOL. So there's, there's gonna be some badasses down here. Gags can jump like crazy. Perfect. I think I might reset the skill tree so I can put it onto the critical hit damage one. There we go. Wrong one, wrong one, Bloodwing.
god. We're up, we're up. Pretty freaking awesome. Pretty freaking awesome. Oh, we missed a No. No. Can we nade jump out of here? I can't believe I did that. I do this like every single time I play this freaking mission. That did not work. Nope. Alright. Well, we're stupid. That's what we are. So we're gonna have to go all the way through this twice. Darn it. Darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it, darn it. many as we can find right now, I guess. Oh, there's a badass. Baby, we found the revolver really, really fast. Oh, dang. Oh, dang. And that... Oh, they're all so awesome. Perfect. All right, we gotta level up five more times, is it? And then we can use our revolver. Beautiful, just beautiful. Did we miss any of the blade flower seeds? Hopefully not.
Oh, yeah, we're down. That's what I was trying to do the whole time, which is melee. So I think we missed two. I don't know that. So many to choose from. We don't need no shotgun. Yeah, we missed three. Yeah, there's one right there, one right there, three. Let's just switch to the other mission now. Lots of running, though. Lots of running. Our revolver looked decent, but not nothing amazing. Let's look at it again. But it is a revolver, so. 92 damage. Better than any sniper I've seen. It takes me a lot longer, like to level 15 or something, to find the revolver. But we found one at level 8, pretty solid. But once we find the legendary revolver, oh my gosh, it's gonna go in back. An equalizer. Yeah, that's what we need. Equalizer. Is so first playthrough. What's the doll? Uh... All right, let's see. Yeah, since burst fire, is it doll? That's TDR. So I don't know. I am new when it comes to these border rom guns. Never played too much of it. Compared to Borderlands, so that I have played in the game. And Except for the guns. Nope, no, 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 no. Whoops. I want to unbind the top key, actually. That's a good idea. Even can. It's 
see if you can do that. I'll never press that button, never, so. Perfect. I will never get choked up again with talking. Perfect. Oh, it's where we killed him. I think it went flying. Must have, because that's where... It... There it is. Alright. What? You like that? Or we could just totally ditch this skill. So, yeah. That actually be kind of nice, too. You know, it is a nice to have that bonus 500% melee at a random chance. Now that we have a revolver, it don't really matter. So, what did we find in here again? Peter, cheap SMG. Yeah, that's lame. Okay. Bonehead. That's a lot of running. At least it's unlimited sprint. That is nice. I said we just go kill Bonehead now. Don't even worry about turning the other stuff. And don't even bother killing those guys because nothing is gained from that. Well, actually, where is the turn in at? There. To TK. TK. Oh, I could have just checked there. Yeah, let's just go kill him right now. Feed it. Alright, where is he? got this. Oh, yeah. I got him. 
Let's see what we got. Oh man, so many challenges. Okay, that's a pretty solid gun. In my opinion. So we're gonna rock that for a little bit. And there is the destruct module back here. Is there a chest in here? No. Got it. Now we can go turn in all of our missions. We have a lot of them, that's for sure. Alright. Turn this one in. Get a car and go run over to TK. My runners ain't the prettiest gal at the dance, but she'll put out the second you ask her. And be sure to hit the boost to know ever wants to catch her. Ride with the scooter man. You're not a skag, are you? Look at you. What did we just get from him? Mostly in. It's got TK's wave and one of these, I think. Oh, that's cool. Hey, hey, TK's wave is a black gun, that's for sure. So he has no missions for me. Turn that in. See what else we can rock. Perfect. We'll get to level thirteen in no time. Roadkill enemies. I think there's one back here, yeah. Shooting that gun like that reminded me of how amazing the bitch is in this game. Show God. Alrighty. Stop number one. This journal in here. All about Tannis and insanity. Day one on planet Pandora. I have been assigned to this sector by my superiors to find evidence of abandoned alien technology similar to that found by our competitor, the Atlas Company, in the ruins on Prometheus. Technology that many believe made them the superpower they are now. Astronomically improbable on a rock like this. But my benefactors believe in it enough to waste my considerable talents. I've only been here for three hours, and I already believe this planet will be the death of me. Scientists do not chase myths and legends. Sorry about all the... I don't know if you can tell or not, but there's going to be a lot of cuts because people are talking it to be the into the mic. Mike can pick them up. The moonlight cycles are difficult to get used to. The planet rotation day is over 90 hours long. The people that inhabit this salted dust ball are as ignorant as I've seen in this galaxy. 
when I attached the ball. Now, did you just leap over piss wash gully and one of my runners? Man, dude, tell me when you're gonna do that crap. That was awesome. <laughs> That door is the broken one. Which door is the fixed one? This one, right? Or just either? Either of them work, never mind. Is it on the roof? Just on the side of the house. We'll see. Oh, there we go. Oh, are you kidding me? That's right. Come on. Yeah, we're screwed. Well, we're dead. How far away did we spawn? Jesus Christ. So far away. That was so stupid. Perfect. Perfect. We'll skip out on that one, I think. We'll just go five and five in there, and then go there. That will be perfect, in my opinion. Oh, elemental weapon. Yeah. Yeah, we have way too much guns. Whatever, it's fun. Not as strong as the other one, but it's definitely. And there's probably some elemental challenges too. So we might as well do. How'd you get up there? I thought I I don't want any of those snipers. Alright. Right in here. Day. There we I go. I was woken up, hoping I was having a reoccurring nightmare. We spent more than 36 hours earlier today relocating our campsite closer to our dig site, only to be ambushed by local wildlife that's hungry coming out of hibernation. Half of my staff was eaten alive or killed by scags. I survived by hiding under a colleague of mine who was being devoured on top of his name was Carl. My emotions are deadened, and I grieve for none of them. In point of fact, the only emotion I felt was that of joy. I felt joy because his chair was always more comfortable than mine. I took his chair, 
And then I noticed the emissive glow on the rocks at the dig site. Yeah, that is weird. So we're gonna finish this mission, and then we're gonna call this call it quits for today. All right, why don't you come on back? Day one hundred nineteen. I sat in the shower in tears for just under an hour. This is interesting, considering we haven't had water for days. I equate my ever decreasing sanity with that of the population of my dig site. With the investigation of the symbols and glowing patterns of the site, we finally unearthed arguably certifiable proof of the existence of alien life having been here on Pandora. But this celebration was lonely, as I only have two colleagues left. And I'm not too fond of the fat girl, Shimei. I've been told that scientific discovery requires sacrifice, but I never understood what they meant until now. Come on. Come on, car. We did it. We gotta see that gap in our foot here. Alright, road kill time. Nobody kills my buddy! Ooh! Ooh! Holy! Oh my gosh! Holy crap, that was so many racks. Holy mother of God. Why? Why? Yeah, we're never gonna Wow, two deaths, one episode. Yeah, we suck. And the car blew up, even worse. Well, we're just going to end it off here because I died too many times. So thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did enjoy, please leave a like down below. And I will see you in the next episode. See you guys later.